All right, question number 54, let's get right into it. So we have that given that P is a positive number, N is a negative number, and P, the absolute value of P is greater than the absolute value of N, which of the following expressions has the greatest value? All right, guys, so if you remember that if we have a fraction, right, so let's say I had like, um, I don't know, A divided by B, right? If, we, we, if we're dividing by a number, right, we want the denominator to be very low, right? So we want this to be low, and I want this to be high if we want to get the greatest value, right? So um, the one that we can just automatically go ahead and cross off is going to be one that has a the high number, which is P on the bottom. We don't want that. Let's get rid of that one. Um, let's see here. Let's get rid of this one. And let's get rid of this one right here. Okay. So now we're left with P plus N divided by N and P minus N divided by N. So remember that n is a negative number, right? So if n is a negative number, if I have p minus n and n is a negative number, this is really just like saying p plus n, right? Or p plus, or let's just, let, let's write it this way, p minus n, right? Now if n equals two, sorry, negative two, and this is really p minus minus two, this is really p plus two, right? Um, so actually, this is gonna give us a large numerator and we have the same denominator in both cases. So it's going to be G because we get a larger numerator, okay? So hopefully that makes sense. If you have any questions, feel free to comment below, and I'll see you guys in the next video.